Okay, we got Go Hard or Go Home is in first place with three wins. 1v1 owned got second place with two wins and broken with third place with one win. Very good job by all competitors. We really appreciate you guys playing. What's up? How's it going, Ganked and Morg? Good. So, how do you enjoy your tournament here? You guys did really well getting into, uh, well, Ganked got into second place. And more got into first. What seemed to be the the problems with the other matchups for you guys? Let's start with ganked. Uh, um, you mean specifically against which team? Well, yeah. What what really stuck out as uh, one of the things that kind of decided how you guys were switching? What was causing you guys the most problems? Well, I would say the just based on the first matchup we had against Land's team, it's awesome that those guys hopped in. Um, the two physician thing is definitely difficult. So, just saying that, um, whether that's a balance thing or a comp thing, I don't know. Um, but the two physician thing is definitely extremely difficult because our team is based on mana draining and you can't mana drain a physician yeah so that's very difficult um and i think that uh the three dps that uh morg and cupcakey's team had is just was just too much for what we, what we had uh, they hit us like a truck they did a great job i mean the even not even attacking a healer us just standing there and healing we couldn't do anything about it just way too much damage yeah, definitely. Uh, what, before I switch over to Morg with the same question, what spec was you mainly running, Ganked? I did three or four. I, I did two or three Sin specs and uh, Physician Rift Stalker spec. We tried to do the uh, Physician Bard uh, with, with Slow Shot as Bard for Uncleansable Sleeps. And uh, it usually works pretty well. I mean, we used it in that last that last round of the tournament there, that last match, and it worked fine. But I mean, they focused the DPS and still were able to do it just because their damage is really high. PVE weapons certainly help, but I mean, ultimately their damage is just way higher than ours. Yeah. So, Morg, what seemed to be the problem for your team the most? I mean, what was the things that was causing your team problems, but it seemed like you guys were able to overcome anything that you encountered? Well, uh, I would like to say that the two warriors carried the awful knife blade damage. <laughs> so, what spec were you running mainly, Morg? Uh, in every single match I was running, night. All right. So, <laughs> not giving yourself enough credit, huh? No, Nightblade is very underpowered. It's been underpowered for a long time. It needs a buff. Yeah. So, Landslide, thank you for filling in at the last minute. We were almost in dire straits if it wasn't for you forming a team last minute and getting in here and helping us out. How was your experience with this tournament? Uh, you know, uh, I, I got my butt kicked, but I had a pretty good time, man. And, uh, you know, I, I'm always happy to support anybody who wants to do something like this when I can. Um, you know, <laughs> we did kind of get together last minute, so we kind of we, we didn't really have a game plan or know what we were doing. We were just trying to find five people and uh, kind of figure out what we were going to do. So we, we tried a whole bunch of different stuff, which... Uh, I thought it was a good experience for us. You know, uh, that was only the second time I've ever done anything like this before. And uh, it's kind of funny. The, the situation was exactly the same. Some, somebody had dropped out last minute. And I think it was one that Hostile was running back in the day sometime early last year. And, uh, you know, it was fun, man. I, I enjoyed it. You know, I like stuff like this. Yeah. We really appreciate you filling in the way that you did. So, Garganto, what was your experience with this? You were doing insane heals, but 
Yeah, it seemed like you were getting pressured all the time. Yeah, I mean, that, that pressure was just insane. I mean, hands down to Nephi and, uh, Nephi and Naked Stone and their crew. I mean, that was just pretty crazy. And, I mean, we had, we had a lot of fun. We got our, again, we got our butts kicked, but a lot of fun. Uh, I love competitive PvP. Uh, we were a little ill-prepared. Uh, we're a brand new team. I mean, we've only ran together for the last two nights in preparation. Kind of a last-minute thing, but, uh, you know, it was a lot of fun, and, yeah. Congratulations to the guys who competed and won, and we did. Yeah, thank you so much for competing with us as well as Garganto. It was really nice seeing you guys PvP, and I hope you guys will come back for a future one as well. Uh... Yeah, I mean, any kind of final thoughts from you guys? I mean, you really did good jobs out here, and, you know, you're supporting the PvP community a lot, and we can't say enough good things about you guys competing over and over like all of you seem to be doing. All right, well, uh, with all too serious this time, I do thank you for putting this together. Uh, you put a lot of work into this arena, and it, it really shows. I mean... The teams that came here, you guys were all great. And I uh, really applaud Landslide's team for and uh, Garganto. Um, and in particular, Landslide, because he kind of put this all together at the very last minute. And came in here and fought. Yeah, definitely. So... Who all is going to be in the next one? Are all of you guys planning on competing in the next one? Or are you going to take a break? Or what's going on? Are we going to get to see all of you guys in it again? Oh, I'll be there. I'm sure to see I'll us. We need, we need a rematch. Maybe a different comp. Maybe a different comp. I would love to find a love to find a team. I don't know why it's so hard to find a people to get together and just have a time. Somebody had some speakers. Somebody had some speakers with speakers. Yeah, I got some serious reverb there. <laughs> but uh, you know, I like this stuff. It's fun. You know, I, I wish people were less scared about losing and more interested in just coming in and have a good time. You know, that, that's what it should really be about. You know, and. Uh, you know, so what if you're not the best? You're only going to get better the more that you play. So, uh, you know, come in, have some fun, if you lose, you know. Most people are very appreciative that you just came and, and went out and, you know, played, you know. That's that's what I like to do. Absolutely. Yep, you, you can't get better if you don't play. I completely agree with Landslide. Agreed. And now we're getting a different kind of competitive formats for you guys that normally you have to kind of try to display all of your abilities, whether it's in Warfront or Conquest or whatever kind of skill you like to do. But now we're able to do the 5v5s and the 3v3s so that you can kind of define a whole different aspect of the gameplay, which I know a lot of you guys really enjoy this smaller scale PvP the way that it is. So I guess this yeah, we is. Love this. I mean... Oh, go ahead, Garganto. I was just gonna say. I mean, back back in the day, I PvP with a lot of these guys we see here. Uh, smaller scale is just a lot of fun. It kind of disappeared for a while, and I really appreciate Allo and yourself getting together, everybody coming and making it competitive and keeping it good. So, thank you guys. Thank all. Yeah, thank you guys so much for competing, and we will be doing another one just shortly. Watch the forums, guys, and make sure that you're paying attention to the next tournament because we are not letting up on this, and it's only going to get better every time. Uh, I'm sure you guys have noticed a very big uh, improvement in the broadcasting and everything that we're doing. So hopefully it will continue to get better and better, and you know I hope you guys just keep, keep doing it. That way we can keep it going. I want to make sure that you guys are going to SIRadio.fm and listening to good music there. Make sure that you send a tale to anybody in the Ominous Guild and tell them that they're awesome for supporting us. And Verity, thank you so much, Verity, for sending us the Black Garden Key. And DJ Crystal, you know, we're, we're promoting your radio station because you've helped us so much with this tournament with providing all of the 
the platinum and everything else and also riftgreat.com guys if you have not been to riftgreat.com make sure you go there they've always promoted our tournament and they are amazing with the rift news so if you've never been there go there you will be pleasantly surprised the mvp i must say the mvp also was uh 1v1 gank uh, 1v1 owned i keep on saying gank because that's the guy i'm talking to the team lead so it is 1v1 owned oh, got the mvp award so that is the winner there and that pretty much wraps up this 5v5 tournament as you can see the winners are up there on the podiums we had a very exciting match well many matches between many great pvpers and that was very fun to watch guys you guys are really exciting to watch we only had one match even go to time limit and there was still kills in that one match so yeah really good stuff thank you guys and we will see you at the next godlike arena and we will be sending a dream soul bundle to Zolid and mvp awards and everything else and thank you guys at godlike awesomeness putting on everything giving away all these prizes everything amazing amazing amazing